Let's go ask Chev's technicians what the hardest car to work on is. Let's go. Uh, diesel Tahoe. It's got to be any car that doesn't have a General Motors logo on the front of it. That's the right answer. I mean, what's the hardest car to work on? Oh god, I don't know. I'm not a mechanic. Uh, I'd have to say it's the old Pontiac Montana, especially when it had the handicap controls and wheelchair assist in it. That is very niche. How many of those have you worked on? One. It was brutal. The diesel Chevy Express van, by far. How bad? Uh, extremely bad. Traumatizingly bad? Well, I lost my hair over it, so. <laughs> What's the hardest car to work on? <gasps> um, a Corvette, because <laughs> um, because the parts are small. <laughs> I'd say Corvettes are probably the hardest ones to work on. Why, why are Corvettes the hardest ones to work on? They're expensive and everything's tightly packaged. That's fair. Yeah. yeah. They said all the parts were small. Exactly, yeah. Just from what I've seen at least, I'd probably say a C8 just because of how like packed together it is. That's fair. It's not a whole lot of real estate in yeah, there. Yeah, exactly. A whole lot of parts, not a lot of real estate, so <laughs> yeah, I'm just going to say that.